Region. Some people have traveled from the other side of the globe just for this very event. To your side, photojournalist Katie Brown shares their story in their own words. It's not normal to have the chance to go on board one replica of the, of the ship from 500 years ago. This is a good way to, to know a piece of history of uh, our country and, and your country, you know. I, I think that ship is two, two ships, okay? When we are in port, when we are docked, we work like a museum. So all the deckhands, including me, uh, the captain, we are here for the guests, you know, to explain how we live, how we work, telling stories to the visitors. They start with this, yeah. We work one day and then we have one day off. For us, it's very important to improve our English and uh, so the people are giving us a good opportunity because the people want to speak with us and we need to improve it. We try to speak with the hands or something and the, the person who was is like trying to teach us English. You aim us, you know, to, to find and second part is when we are sailing. When we are sailing, it's like a n normal ship. In, this m in that moment, we are sailors. We are, uh, we are a team. We sleep in a bedroom with 15 bumpets. Sleep in the banks. How I feel? <laughs> it's really hard to explain because sometimes you, my neighbor in the bank is snorkeling. How do you say it? It's snorkeling? So he's snoring and uh, boom, hit you and you stay like this. We are brothers and sisters with different mothers and with uh, different fathers. This is like a summer camp for adults. That's great. That is. It is something yeah. to see. Tens of thousands of people have already seen it and tens of thousands more will go down there this week.